What's going on legends? Welcome back to the channel and I hope you're doing amazingly today. We've been trying out a few builds on stream recently and this one is pretty insane. Using the new Nemesis perk Lethal Pursuer shows you survivors auras at the beginning of the game, combine that with Blight and you can land your first hit within seconds. Adds a little bit of corrupt intervention to the mix and it creates so much early game pressure that most survivors won't be able to recover. I really hope you enjoy the video, leave a like and comment down below to help the channel out and maybe catch us live on Twitch. Have an awesome day and I'll catch you again soon. Cold Tower, let's go actually. Like the best map in the game, dude. Jelta Woods would have been a little bit crazy, you know? Uh, Jack Litton, what's going on, man? How's the best DVD streamer doing? Oh, thank you, man. Thank you. That's way too kind. Um, I'm doing great today, man. Cannot deny it. I'm doing fantastic. And let's see. I reckon, do you think we get a hug tech? Oh, we don't need one. And flick. So those little mini jukes that they do, you're going to want to shoulder flick them. If they're like really quick and they're doing like camera turns, uh, shoulder flick is going to be the best way to guarantee a shot there. Oh, interesting. I've got a plan, actually. Like that. Like that. Keep facing the dead hard. No dead hard on Feng by the looks of it. Perfect. Uh, is Coup de Gras good on Blind? Uh, no, not for the most part, Smith. Because because of the um, the, the lethal rush counts as a, um, a special attack, it doesn't increase your lunge. So, like, for example, you know how Coup de Gras increases the spirit's lunge? Uh, it doesn't really do the same thing on Blight, sadly. Um, some cold tower spices. You know it, dude. Uh, hold on. We maybe get, like, over there. Perfect. Look at that, man. All the way across the map. Let's go, man. Parkour Blight all day long, dude. Oh, that gen's got some progress. Let's see. I don't know how fun it would be. Oh, it'd be incredible, right? Third Prestige Quentin. And a Jeff as well. Terrifying. Jeff with uh, Spring Burst, by the looks of it. Good timing on that pallet break as well. What? Wait, Elytra, have you never seen Space Blight before? That's going to be a great spot, actually. Going to pull that on that pallet as well. Oh, he wants to go for the window. That's going to be a slap. Little cheeky bit of a hug tack into Butter Shack there. He's going to want to leave this tile, though, man. He's not going to get anywhere if he sticks around Shaq. And he knows that. Yep, he knows that. I can sense a dead hard coming up, though. Are you guys ready? Come on, man. You got this. Show me that dead hard. Wait. Never mind. I take it back, actually. Ooh, I don't know, man. If I pick that guy up, then Feng is going to go for the uh, for hit. Like that, right? Really, really quick spins from Feng. you got to be so quick to react to those. Uh, Randy, what's going on, buddy? Welcome in. Love the name, dude. Wait, you're here? Ooh, I've got a plan, actually. Yeah, one of these into a... Uh, what do you reckon? Hugtech 180? Yes! Hugtech 180. Slap down, man. Uh, Dragonov, what's going on? Appreciate the follow, man. Hope you're having the best day of all time, dude. Mad Grit Sweaty. I know, man. Mad Grit Value. Let's go, dude. <laughs> yes! Okay, there's another one down. Perfect. Hmm. Oh, he has live. Very awesome. Oh, dude, a nice cheeky bit of pallet pocos as well, man. Clean as that, dude. He had sprint burst? Yeah, he had sprint burst. Okay, so let's see. What have we got? I guess we can just, like, take out a couple pallets. I usually don't like taking out pallets on, um, on pallet gyms, but it is kind of connected to other things. Oh, that would have been a little bit too spicy. I think if I went from a different angle, I could have maybe got on that one, you know? Uh, pocos. Extreme pocos. Poor dude is raging right now. I know, dude. Straight up molding, man. Uh, I'll, 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 I'll break the door. I can get this done. Okay, third prestige Quentins are the only characters in the game that actually terrify me. So we've got to be very careful here. Oh, interesting. Yeah. What are you going to do, dude? What are you going to do? Yep. Dude, the hug tech combined with double speed, it gives them zero, zero time to react. There is nothing you can do in that position, you know? Unless you're like, you've literally got like one millisecond reaction times, which is never going to happen, right? Uh, Crane wants to see some Mori time. Dude, sounds like a plan, man. From which game slash movie is Blight? Uh, he's not. He's an original character, believe it or not. Ooh, Jeff is sounding uh, pretty, pretty tasty right now. Perfect shot. Ghoulish. What's going on, buddy? Triple nine. Hope you have the best day of all time, dude. Ooh, he screwed up, man. And fuck off. Clean, dude. Did you bring the Mori? Uh, not in this game, Crane. No, we can bring it in the next one, though, if you like. That was amazing. What perks at the bottom? That one is Corrupt Intervention. Uh, if you type in exclamation mark icons in chat... I've got a custom icon pack. Can't quite hit that. Not quite. You can hit people as they're vaulting, but not if they're on the other side. You know, it's a little bit rough. Let's see. If I go there and then wait. Perfect. Always the patience, man. You know, you never want to, like, rush and swing and then, like, you know, let a survivor, you know, take advantage of that, you know? Uh, hey, what's going on, Golden Slendy, my main duder? Yeah, it's going to wait. 
Still gonna wait. Oh, she had dead hearts. Did you see that? The dead hearts at the window? Oh my god, dude. Oh my god, that was a cracked dead heart, dude. Okay, that sounds like the second gen's about to be completed. But a golden welcome in, man. Great to see you. Watching this and realizing um, how you get some dirty hits. Yeah, there's some pretty crazy stuff going on, man. Oh, interesting. I might actually convert for Jeff. Jeff is in a slightly, uh, slightly worse position right now. Although, I could convert for Jeff and then go back for... Oh, Jeff again. Okay, never mind. Oh, don't you be... <laughs> the dead heart, man. Cracked gamer moves. Good stuff. Good stuff, dude. I want to go for the window. Come on. Not quite the Pocos in that one. Let's see if we can get like a slightly spicier hit on Jeff. I don't want to get a normal one, you know? Okay, never mind. Jeff does not want the spicy flicks, dude. Uh, what happened to the OP dead hard? We all know uh, it made you, you, you lunge longer. Um, I kind of felt like it was a bit too OP running dead hard. You know, Piggy? Um, so for now, I've, 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 I've taken off, you know? Almost. Okay. There, I kind of had to do like a correctional flick because I thought she was going to spin. She just kept holding W, man. I think Blight is a Chad. Dude, can we get some Omega Chad Blights in chat? Of course. Perfect. That was right at the end of the, uh, the slam duration as well. Perfect. Almost went into fatigue there. James, my dude. What's going on, Rachel? Welcome in. Dead Heart is very OP. Oh, it's a crazy OP, right? I see gamers. I see Jeff gamers. Okay, Jeff had Sprint Burst, which I think he just used. May have potentially wasted that one. I want to go for Quentin if I can. Whereabouts is Quentino when you need him? There he is, man. Third prestige. Absolutely terrifying. Do you hear there is going to be a new Blight skin July 27th? Yeah, it's going to be part of the other Greek collection. Which is mega exciting, you know? LT walls, man. There's not a whole lot you can do against Blight on LT walls. It depends on the map. It depends what's around them. There's not a whole lot you can do against them, you know? Uh, Frodo, what's going on? Appreciate the follow. Welcome in, my main dude. Hope you've had an, an amazing day today. Uh, Crane wants to give Blight top hat as well. Damn, guys. You guys are right. You guys are treating Blight today. I love it. Oh, hold on. 180. Yes, 180. A little bit of a slow-mo one. I don't think she quite reacted in time. Let's see. Commit to the window. Oh, she doesn't. <laughs> Just standing there. Good job, man. Good job. Let's see if we can convert this. So that tree is in the perfect position. Let's see. Do you reckon 180? Oh, close to the 180. I should have had a little bit more speed going into that one, man. Does push her away from the tile, though. But, uh, Rachel, it's so good to see you today. I hope you've had a wonderful day so far. I have such a uh, such strong feeling that he's going to get some wings on his feet for the Greek collection. Do you reckon? The wings on the feet. But come on, dead hard. Yes! Caught on camera, dude. Excellent, man. <laughs> uh, nerves of steel. I know, Golden. I know. To be fair, to be fair, good job, man. Good job. She's not panicking. You know, the, the one thing you don't ever want to do against the Blight is panic, you know? You always want to try... I mean, he's tough because he's terrifying. You always want to try and keep your cool, you know? Gonna shoulder shoulder bump up here so we can get up in one rush. Perfect. But that that in Shaq is a really good example of where the um the the, uh, the backup collision can really be beneficial for Blight, you know. Uh, how does um how does looking down help to 180? Um, the quick answer is that Blight has two forms of collision detection. The first one's a ray cast that's connected to the middle of your face, right? So you know how if I look down, hold on, can I find an object that I, that I, that I can actually hit behavior? Okay, never mind. I can't hit any of these objects. I'll show you in a second. Basically, he has two forms of collision detection. Hmm. What if we go all the way through here to the end? And then... Wait, hold on, Quentin. Come on. Yes! Perfect conversion. That is how you convert them, dude. Across the map. Let's go. Um, effectively, looking down, um, imagine like your... Your primary collision detection is like a line that's coming out the middle of your camera, right? So it's looking up now, it's looking down now. If I look down, then it ignores that primary collision detection. 180 around the corner, clean. And when it does, it pretty much allows you to choose when you slide off of objects, you know? Vinteon, dude, it's great to see you, buddy. Hope you do well today, man. Why do you run Shadowborn? Is it just because you like the FOV? Oh, there's no there's no hook there. My bad. <laughs> Slight Pepega moment, dude. It's okay, though. Uh, the the uh, FOV increase in that tool? Yeah, exactly. Um, I very rarely run four perks. My go-to build is just Shadowborn and Barbecue. I don't really like running, you know, anything more than that. So to me, I don't really miss out on anything um, by having Shadowborn. And on top of that, something I quite like about running Shadowborn is that when I recommend a build to someone, they can kind of stick something on top of it, you know? So for example, the Bulldozer build. You know how I recommend, like, you know, Brutal Strength, um, uh, Enduring and Spirit Fury, or something like that. Uh, Spirit Fury, Enduring Lethal Pursuer, something. Um, what you can do is it, it lets people try that build, but also